Seven for 35. Series highs for Siakam and Ibaka tonight for Toronto. Pascal Siakam goes for 23 points. He led the way for the Raptors. It was Jason Tatum with 24 to lead the scoring for the Boston Celtics. But Toronto, back-to-back wins. And this series is all tied at two games apiece. Just what we expected from the Raptors and the Celtics. Let's send it down to Allie LaForce. Pascal, the shots were falling tonight after this team shot 28% from three in the series. 17 made threes tonight. How did you guys get the offense back on track? Um, just continue to play, continue to move the ball. Um, we're taking good shots, man. They just they just weren't going in, and um, we just got to continue to trust our work. And, um, you know, that's that's something that this team does great is, you know, we trust the work. We work every day. And, um, you know, sometimes it falls in, sometimes it doesn't. And uh, today, tonight it happened to fall, so uh, we take it. How many defenses do you have? <laughs> I, mean, I don't know. I don't know a lot of them, man. Um, great, great from the coaching staff, you know, just putting us in position to, you know, switch things up and, and, and just go in our repertoire and, and just find things. And I think at the end of the day, it's just guys willing to do it, right? Like, if, if you have guys willing to, to battle and, and, and work hard every single night, like, you can do those things. You have the luxury of doing that if you have guys that, that are committed to doing it. So that's what we are. Listen, you were one perfect pass and essentially a miracle away from going down 3-0, which no team has overcome. Now you're back in this fight. What did that win and tonight's win do for the psyche and the mentality of this basketball team? Um, you know, just, like, it feels like we're starting over, you know, like, um, Everything felt like it wasn't going our way for, for a while. And, you know, having that shot from, from OG, you know, a big shot, um, you know, just, just kind of giving us our confidence and our boost back a little bit. Coming back tonight, you know, hard fought victory. And, and that's what we're going to do every single night against that team. It's a great team that we're playing against, and um, it's not going to be easy. Uh, we know that. So uh, we just continue to work hard. And, and I think that's the, a testament to the character of the guys that we have. We have guys that work hard and, and guys that are overlooked and, and guys that know that, you know, at the end of the day, this is all we have. And we play together. Um, and, you know, I appreciate my teammates just always being there for me. And no matter what happens, you know, even shots fall in or not, like they're always going to be there for me. And I think that's all you can ask for, for teammates. And, and I'm really grateful for that. And I'm going to continue to work hard. Like, that's one thing I'm going to do. Like, I, I, I promise that I'm going to always work hard. And uh, no matter the result, no matter the, 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 the points that I score, you're going you're gonna to see me go out there and play hard. Congratulations. See you Monday. Thank you. Yep. Ah, the pride of Cameroon. Big night is best of the series. Toronto evens his series at two games apiece. Now it's time for Nuggets Clippers on TNT.